Like for the week. I mean, I know we're already done with Monday now at this point, but like I'm I can't I want it to be more weekend. I need a little I need like the weekend to be the work week and the work week to be the weekend. I can't I can't do this anymore, guys. I really can't. <laughs> uh although today was a good day. Today was a good easy day at work, but man, I just I can't. I have like another 30 fucking years of work or 40 years, whatever. I can't, I can't do it. <laughs> I was not made for this. I hope everybody had a great weekend. There you go, baby girl. Thank you for the head pets. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, yeah, I mean, I had a pretty easy day. My boss is like off on Mondays now forever. And, uh, she works 10 hour shifts, but somehow she still leaves before I do and I work eight hours. So I don't know how that works, but you know, like I got to stay in my lane, right? Cause that's none of my business. Um, but it's been quieter now, now that she's off more. And then everybody else is, um, took the 10 hour shifts and has like one random day off during the week or 10, depending on who you are. And, uh, so it like the last two weeks have been kind of like very chill and very like different and i chose not to do the 10 hour days because i just i don't want to i don't i don't want to working 10 hours and then like i would have to change my stream schedule or just not have any time in between and and i just i didn't want to do that so i'm the only dumbass that didn't take the 10 hour days um which whatever whatever uh let's see what's so i don't know how many of you guys knew but like i had some stray a stray cat stray mama cat with five baby kittens wandering to my yard uh about a week ago now and uh this weekend i finally caught them all <laughs> and took them i had to wait until i found like somebody that was willing to take them like a uh, a shelter specifically a no kill shelter because i don't i don't i don't want harm to come to the animal you know what i mean um and i had to wait for like a placement in a facility and stuff but we caught them all over the weekend and they they are safe they're happy i was so proud of myself that that we were able to successfully catch all of them and get them successfully placed together like the whole fam in one um shelter that's no kill and actually it's really funny because the mama cat is already adopted out they're leaving her with the babies until they can be separated um but she's gonna go home with uh the uh secretary at the place where i took her uh where i took her and the fam oh yeah yeah i mean rogers you saw pictures of them they were fucking cute weren't they glad mama's all good to go yeah she is also she was chipped which I know I told you, Rogers, because we were talking about it all weekend as I was hunting, <laughs> hunting these kittens. Um, but what you call it? Like, uh, she was also chipped, and it was very obvious that the owner just dumped her, which is very, very sad. And I would have taken her. I really would have taken her or taken one of the kittens. But my own cat, he does not do well with other animals. He will make that other animal miserable. I've tried several times over the years and it just like, that's it. He's just going to have to be alone until he dies. You, you know what I mean? Like, that's just the way. And it's not fair for me to, to bring in an animal that's going to be miserable and to make my cat miserable. You know what I mean? I wanted to reach the screen and just grab them. Oh God, they were so fucking cute. So fucking, I would have taken them all. Like if I didn't have, if my cat wasn't the personality that he was, I would have taken them all and just, and like kind of fostered them until I found them all homes and they could get away from, you know, from mama cat. And I probably would have kept the mama cat with me. Um, and maybe one of the babies and just had, you know, three cats, but I couldn't, there's just no way I could with, with my cat. So, but I was very excited, very excited to get them all somewhere safe and, 
And so I couldn't catch them all in one day because uh, two of the I was able to get the mama and three of the kittens on Saturday and two of the kittens were slippery little suckers and I couldn't get them on Saturday, but I did get them on Sunday and I was so happy to see them all reunited and all together, all in a safe environment. It was so, so like it made my heart so happy. I have such a bleeding heart for animals. Like it's ridiculous. So hi. Hey, Janella, how are you? Happy Monday or Tuesday Eve, whichever you guys need. Uh, we were just talking about the kittens like I had a stray mama cat and five kittens uh, living in my yard for like the last week and a half. And this weekend I got them uh, to like an animal sanctuary. I'm good. Oh, my God. It's Monday. It is. It is. <laughs> Oh, that's great. Yeah, it was great. It was great. It made my heart very happy. And my thing was, my biggest thing was I wanted them to be A, safe. B, I wanted them to be, um, to have the potential to get adopted out, right? Like, I didn't want to just put them somewhere and they stay there forever. You know what I mean? Uh, and the biggest thing, though, was to for it to be a no-kill shelter. So I had to wait for space. Uh, and actually, the one of the ones that I got in contact with they didn't have any kittens, so they were very fucking excited to get the kittens. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And and I was just saying, too, like, I would have kept all of them, but my cat, my cat does not accept other animals in the house. I can't have fish. I can't have birds. I mean, obviously, right? I can't have... Uh, uh, whatchamacallit, like another cat. I can't have a dog. I can't have small children. Like if, if I have a friend come over or somebody company come over that has small children, I have to lock the cat up because he will attack kill uh, the children. I haven't been here since your birthday. Oh my God. Oh, well, hello. Welcome back. Welcome back. Uh, yes, I too have an asshole cat. Yeah. He's just, I don't, I don't know how to describe, like I'm his person and that's it. And nobody's allowed near me. And that's that, like he gets jealous. If my child comes and gives me a hug, he gets jealous. If my dad gives me a hug, he gets jealous. If, uh, like if I fucking put on the wrong color shirt, he's like fucking pissed at me. Like, I, I just, I don't understand him whatsoever, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Um, <laughs> yeah like he really and yo this cat people make jokes all the time like cats are moody and stuff dude if i piss my cat off like piss him off for any like i could i could change food like i could change the food that he gets and he's not happy with it he'll shit in my shoes like our shoes are locked in another room you know what i mean like the door is closed at all times Mine's the same, but he also gets mad if I pet him for more than point one seconds. So mine's actually pretty good about getting pet. He loves pets, um, especially when it's nighttime uh, and it's like sleepy time. And if he doesn't get pets, he will he he paws my face, not like in a in a mean way. And he doesn't have any claws either. He has no claws. Uh, he had some sort of a, an issue when he was a kitten where the claws were growing into his his pads, into the pads of his uh, uh, paws. So they removed all of them. That was the only option for him. Uh, I don't recommend getting claws removed on a cat ever unless it's like a really big need because it hurts them. Um, but in his case, he literally had no choice. Like his, they were literally growing into his pads and like deforming his feet and stuff. He also has six toes on every one of his, uh, all four of his feet have six toes. Um, but anywho, so, um, that's another thing to like, I, I agree. It's like getting your fingertips clipped off. Yes. Yes. And I would have never done, like I made, I had like four or five <laughs> Hey, quick and new sparkle, new sparkle, chat, chat, quick and new sparkle. Um, but yeah, like I would, I would, I don't care about, you know, you know what I mean? Like I'll buy scratching posts galore. I don't care about that kind of stuff. And I just, I just don't want, and I don't recommend getting claws removed on cats because he really went through it. And I went through like four or five different vets, uh, which all said the same thing because I knew, you know what I mean? Like the the dangers or the you know what i mean the 
unhappiness that a cat would have from having his claws removed. And funny story, so he had that done when he was, uh, I want to say, like nine, ten months old, somewhere around there. And, um, oh my God, Rogers, I can't with you. I'm very fortunate that my pupper stays so quiet. Rogers, I can't. I can't. I'm not. I'm not even. I'm not even gonna go there. Oh my god! Like I want to laugh, but I feel bad for laughing at that, Rogers. <laughs> you did the right thing in the end, you know. Thank you, thank you. I, I, I did. I had to do what I had to do, right? He'd want you, you to. Go, it's, thank you for the head pets. Hello, hello, <laughs> Captain, Captain. Thank you for the host. Let me mute this. <laughs> triggered the alarm i think she might be slightly triggered y'all what's up with my vtuber today man is that uh live a live live wait is it live alive live alive let's try something i think i can kill them all with this. my god you hit like eight octaves above your normal voice there sec <laughs> his attacks look cool Yes, it's yes, it's live a uh, live or live. You're yes, thanks. I do that from time to time. <laughs> oh shit. So, but yeah. Um but once once my cat goes, you know what I mean, cuz he's 17 years old and it's one of these days, you know what I mean? It's, the time is coming. Uh but then I will Make sure that if I want more than one animal, I'll get them at one time, so that way they're they're bonded and all that stuff. By the way, I heard you in the beginning, and yes, you have 30 more years of work. 30, 40, something like that, I don't know. At this point, I'm going to be like in the grave, and they're going to be calling or texting me, asking me why I didn't show up. Oh, dang, I'm glad I didn't redeem the dance party. Why? Is something wrong with the dance party? Oh, live alive. Okay. Okay. Got it, got it. All right, I'm doing DBD today. I almost redeemed it right when you started talking about Kitty going soon. Oh no, oh my God, that would have been fucking epic, Captain. That would have been epic. I'll help you out if I win the lottery, all good. Thank you, <laughs> thank you. Funny story, so one time, Koopo. Koopo, what the fuck, man? I'm gonna switch over to a uh, DBD so I don't, you know, get lost. Koopos, but uh, whatchamacallit, uh, one time, you know how it is. Thank you for the dance party, Cap. Thank you. Um, but Koopa is, so, you know, like, I... A couple years ago, I was carpooling to work, which, by the way, I'm never doing that shit again, Koopos. But anyway, it was a job where a bunch of us worked t together and we all lived relatively close. So we carpooled by carpool. I mean, I fucking drove everybody to work all the time and nobody gave me gas money, Koopos. Hence why I'm never doing that shit again. Anywho, Koopos. So we were talking the one day about what we would do, you know, if we won the lottery, Koopos, because we were we were getting ready to put in for the um for the lottery pool at work you know what i'm saying Koopos? and uh they were talking the other people in the car were talking about yeah i'm gonna do this Koopo. i'm gonna do that Koopo. i'm gonna do this and i told them like so this is my plan y'all if i ever win the lottery Koopos, i swear to god like if you see a random house exploded in pennsylvania for no fucking reason Koopos, and they found three dead bodies I won the lottery, okay, Koopos? You will never see or hear from me again, ever. No one will know. No one will ever know that I won the lottery because I'm literally gonna fake my own death, Koopos, and I'm like buying a fucking island in the Caribbean or something, Koopos. But anywho, so I was joking about that and stuff, Koopos, and um, whatchamacallit, uh, one of the girls was like, what? You wouldn't fucking help me out if you won the lottery, Koopo? Like, what the fuck? Like, that's lame. I'm like, well, I guess I could buy you a car so you could get to work, Koopo. And they were fucking pissed at me and, like, wouldn't talk to me for, like, three weeks because I said that, Koopos. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. What? Not gonna, like, not gonna make you so you can't work. 
You could still work, Koopa. You know what I mean? Uh, 50,000 blood points if you log in to DBD today, Koopos. I'm just going to burn some of my points real quick. I guess I could hit play. I guess I can, Koopos. By the way, hi to everyone I haven't said hi. If I haven't said hi, Koopo. I usually do, I usually do like a waves. You know what I mean? Like if I hop into somebody's chat and there's like multiple people instead of just individually, I just go like this. Because <laughs> it's just easier sometimes, Koopo. Wouldn't now Koopos. be a good time to save your mission? We don't save in DBD. We don't save. I'm going to turn the music off because I'm kind of overstimulated today. And do I have shit in here? I do. Okay, excellent. I got really, really overstimulated while working today just from... I gotta fix my butt. From, like, all the stuff happening at work, the stuff I was doing working on outside of work, my dad bothering me about... Because we're taking a vacation at the end of the month. Uh, we're going away for six days? Seven days? I don't remember. So my dad was bothering me about that while I'm trying to work. <laughs> the kiddo was bothering me about vacation. Well, I shouldn't say bothering. Bothering is a harsh word. But you know what I mean? Like, interrupting, like, my workflow and stuff. But I'm very fucking excited about this coming upcoming vacation. It's been such a long time since I went away anywhere. And we're actually, it's like not a staycation it's a actually going away vacation like not staying at home vacation and i'm very very fucking excited i need it so bad so so bad i'm also a little butthurt because i got sunburn while i was catching kittens this weekend that sounds so nice oh my god yes i'm just gonna plant my fat ass somewhere in the sunshine with headphones and just read. Like, I don't care what everybody else does. I'm gonna fucking read and drink. Not like loads of alcohol, not like shit faced drink, but you, you know what I mean? Like, just shipping on something a little, a little bubbly, a little bubbly and a little icy. You know what I mean? Can I do that? I think it's colder where I'm going. I don't even think I could get shit faced anymore. Listen, you reach a certain point in life where it's just not even fun. You know what I mean? Like now if I so when I was younger, I wouldn't get hung over for the life of me. There was a time or two where I did. But but for the most part, like didn't really have a hangover. And I mean, like could get like blackout shit faced. But, like, now I have, like, three beers, which I don't drink very often because for, you know, reasons. Uh, but now I have, like, three beers and I have a headache for two days. You know what I mean? I'm just like, I'm done. <laughs> I am done. What is that diamond over there? Oh, shit. I didn't look at my task. I might have a task for uh, rift thingies. All right, it's chainsaw, dude. Right? I used to drink a bunch with friends and got shit-faced, but nowadays it's just not fine. No. I'm, like, upset, too, when I get, like, drunk. All right, I see him running over there chasing somebody. I'm gonna go over here. I feel like I went the furthest I possibly could for a gen. I wish I could know what I'm like drunk, but man, I can't do nothing. <laughs> now it's just not fun. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, it's not. I don't like how I feel after I drink. Me neither. Not anymore. You know what I mean? Like when you're 19, 20, 21. I'm sorry. 21, 22. It's, f it's fun. But man, like, now it's like, shit, if I go drinking, I gotta get an Uber or a designated driver. I need a chaperone because I'm a fucking idiot. You know what I mean? Like, lived party life from 24 to 28. Short party life. Yep. <laughs> All 
I had a short one too. Mine was not long. I got married like a dumbass very young. Very young. Very, very, very young. But you know, we live, we learn. Oh, he right there. All right, we're gonna go save. We're gonna go save this person. I didn't go out on my 21st because I was older than everyone else by like six months. And yeah, so this is what happened for my 21st. Uh, the day before, the day before my birthday, Oh, 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 oh. So my birthday's on the 26th. Uh, the day before, the 25th, my friends and I went out and we waited until midnight. And then at midnight, son of a fuck, man. Yeah, damn, like shit, they're, everybody's down, like everybody's down. Come here and let me heal your ass. Um, God, I have to actually play, guys, hold on. <laughs> um, But we went out uh on the 25th, so I was still 20. And then at midnight, I shit you not, it was like a fucking wave of alcohol was thrown at me. Uh, because everybody knew that I was turning 21 at midnight. Where the fuck is he? Well, I'm gonna save the person at least, or try. <laughs> Cause he right behind me! Um, and then... Four hours later, I was on a plane with my dad. Well, yeah. I was on a plane with my dad on the way to Vegas, and my dad is like, let me go ahead and buy you your first legal beer. And I'm just like, oh, God, no. Oh, God, no. <laughs> Please don't. Please, Dad, no. <laughs> but that's what I did for my, my 21st birthday was my dad took me uh, to Las Vegas Great start, yeah. Immediately hung over. Immediately. And then our flight was delayed, so I was sitting there, like, nursing a extreme hangover. And my dad, my dad, God bless his soul, uh, had no idea I was hung over. He's just like, did you not sleep? So what had happened, too, this is, this is an important detail to note. Uh, my parents had just gotten separated. So... And I was in my 20s going to school, working full time and going to school full time. Um, and so I was doing uh, I was switching between my parents because I was I was staying with my mom and staying with my dad, helping them, you know, do what they had to do. You can't see me, right? Shit, you can. Shit. Nope, nope. Fucking no, <laughs> no. <laughs> he is coming for me right now. He's got a massive boner for me right now. Yes, get those Jenny's babies. Get them. Yes, fuck you, sir. <laughs> no, 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 no. No. Yeah. Oh, damn. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I had him going for a while, though. That was a long ass run. <laughs> Excuse me. Also, he sounds like an actual pig. Wait, who sounds like an actual pig? Hold on, let me scroll up. Uh, 
Oh, the the dude. Yeah, yeah. The noises that he makes, he does. He does. There you go, baby girl. Thank you for the head pets. Oh, he's going for the knock everybody down. That's kind of lame. I'm going to take a chance. Oh, I might as well, because he's kind of being a douchebag. Oh my god, run, baby. Run, 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 run. Fuck me. Like, he's got to know I'm running for the other person, right? Like... Go, baby, go! Get. I thought there was a gap! This is fine. The other person would be dead, dead. Oh, I'm dead, dead, too, because I made it to second phase. I didn't... Fuck! Fuck! This is fine. This is fine. I hope the real G makes it out. Oh, goodness gracious. Uh, two out of five. Generates fragile white glyphs. Take it to a dangerous place without rushing, falling, or being injured. Okay, so I do have to get those white glyphs. Ah, oh, shit balls, shit balls. What about the rest of y'all? Does anybody have any vacations coming up? I actually do have a follow up vacation question then, too. Um, something I was thinking about doing uh, this fall, but I don't know if I want to do it. And I wanted to hear if anybody had ever done it. No vacay for me, but moving in less than two weeks. Oh my goodness. Moving is almost like a vacation, right? <laughs> I'm gonna take a vacation to the kitchen, I suppose. I go absolutely nowhere. Is it is it a better deal, like the 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 move? Like, are you getting a better deal somewhere else, or circumstances, job changes, or just felt like it? I second that. I also hope it's a better place. Better looking and cheaper. Oh, yes. Better deal. Moving in with my uncle so it's cheaper by far. Oh, for sure. Yes. Yes. Same thing. Like my dad, uh, when uh, he decided... So when he retired, he moved to Poland. And then he decided he wanted to come back. And he wanted to get his own apartment and stuff. And I'm like, why? Why? Why waste the money? Like, just come here. Well, I hope you all move goes smooth. Yeah, same, same. Hopefully it's quick and easy. So then my follow-up vacation question is, has anybody ever done like RVing? Like rented an RV or had family that had an RV or anything like that? Because we were thinking... Uh, not on this little trip that we have coming up, which it's really not that big of a deal, but um, sometime this year we were thinking about doing like a little, like where we rent an RV. No, but I'd love to. I also really fucking want to. And there's two reasons behind it. Because I understand you're renting the RV if you're, you know, obviously if you're renting or, you know, buy one, but I don't want to really buy one and then find out I don't like it. You know what I mean? But one of the big reasons is, um, so like, uh, I'm going away for in December for, uh, like a week and a half and I have to figure out what to do with my pet. You know what I mean? Like I have to figure out what to do with my cat. Um, like I can board him, but he's going to be fucking miserable. I can pay somebody to come to my house, but you know how it is when you pay somebody to come to your house, they... I just I don't trust people 
You know what I mean? And the last couple of times that I had different people come to the house, they came like literally the last day and showed up. And, and you know what I mean? Like if I'm paying you and I tell you, OK, like I'm paying you, I pay you well, first of all. Um, and I want you to feed my cat, change his water and empty the litter. Those are the only things that I need to be done. And maybe give him some pets or something like that's that's about it. You don't really he's he's a pretty low maintenance kind of dude. Right. Um. And then I come home and the litter box is full. You know what I mean? Like that just pisses me off. That just pisses me off because my cat, he's a very dainty cat and he's the kind of cat. Well. It, <laughs> I was like tunnel visioning for the for the glyph. <laughs> but he's the kind of cat where if his litter box isn't like perfectly fresh. He gets uh, annoyed and irritated and he won't use it. Do you know what I mean? So it's kind of imperative that the litter box... Fuck, man. Fuck, man. It's imperative that the litter box is... You know what I mean? Like, that's spotless, but, like, I can't have, like, pounds of shit in the litter box. You know what I mean? That's awful. My sister does pet sitting and always makes sure to go above and beyond. See, I don't even want people to go above and beyond. Just literally just the things I asked you to do. I don't ask for a lot. And and I, I pay well. You know what I mean? Like, it's not like I throw somebody $20. You know what I mean? I've also had people come and stay in my house, like, on a longer vacation where um, I asked them, like, please eat all the food. And I did, like, a big grocery shop for them before I left and paid them and didn't, you know, obviously, you know, utilities were on me and all that, you know, obviously, because it's my house. And then they treated my house like shit, you know what I mean? And they still didn't do the thing that they were there for, which is to take care of my cat. That's literally all I need is just feed him. He is such a self-sufficient uh, little dude that literally that's all I need is just feed him and clean the litter box and give him some pets. All right, I think I have to deliver this somewhere. I don't know where I have to take the glyph, but... Don't I have to do something with these tentacles? Fuck me. Ah! Fuck, fuck, I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have. That's what I need is the spray. Seven minutes? I could get it done in seven minutes. But yeah, so I'm just very... But I think the RV would be nice because then I could take my cat with me. You know what I mean? I see the glyph. I see the glyph right there. That's where I need to return my glyph. Thank you. Get rid of them nasty tentacles. But yeah, I think it'd be fun. I think it'd be super fun to be able to, A, take my cat with me. And, uh, be able to care for him. Hey, cutie. Hey, Maggie! How are you? I take it you're done moving? Right? Isn't that, uh, like, why you guys had, like, a little steam, uh, stream break? Got the internets back? I usually, I usually pet sit for my twin and sister-in-law. Nice, nice. The return of the internet is strong. Yeah, we were done, like, a month ago. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, but then, but, you know, by the time you get your utility set up and all that business, unpack, get comfortable. It took a month. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Right, I think I could go after this, Jen. I think. 
Plus, depending, depending on the service, right? Like sometimes they want a security deposit, especially if you're on the younger side. Regardless of your credit, they just want a deposit too, and that's always a pain in the balls. I remember one time, so my dad never had internet in his name, ever, ever. And uh, I got pissed at my internet company because they wouldn't let me have, you know, the new the new customer rate and stuff like that. And I was like, okay, well then can I just cancel my account and set it up for the same day under a different name? And they're like, yeah, you could do that. I'm like, okay, well, you know, it's inconvenient that I have to do that, but I'm gonna go ahead and do that because like you're charging me a hundred dollars and the new customer rate is like, you know, $40. So I did it. And, um, when now my dad has excellent credit, excellent credit 800 score excellent right they fucking wanted like a 400 security deposit for my dad putting it in his name i was like are you guys out of your fucking mind for internet that's 40 dollars a month like why don't you just tell us to prepay in advance like just prepay for the whole fucking year that's essentially what you're doing You want to just heal yourself right here, buddy? Internet was scheduled to be installed on the first day before we started moving stuff. The provider we had still doesn't know what's wrong with the service here and can't give us any answers, so we changed for the time being. Gotcha. That's so stupid. Thank you for the heals, my friend. Right? It was stupid. But we paid it. We did pay it. Like, it wasn't an issue of the money. It was just the principle behind it. But we paid it, and then we didn't have to pay because it was literally, like, the internet was 40 bucks a month for, like, uh, two years. But now we just play the game of, uh, for two years it's in my name, for two years it's in Dad's name, for two years it's in my... You know what I mean? Like, that's just what we keep doing now. And it's so stupid that we have to jump through that hoop. I hate it. I used to work for... I gotta turn like this way so it's not so loud. Thank you for the hydrate. I'll do that in a second. Shit happens. Fuck, I don't care. I'm so close. I don't care. I'm so close. I'm so close. Hey, Rising. All right. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's get out. Rising, the best e-girl outside of me. Salutations! Yo, I really can't be fucking around because I've got two hooks. Fuck! My heart is too good. I don't want to. I don't want to leave. And I can't leave. Fuck! He grabbed them right there. Oh, do I do it? Do I do it? Do I go save? Do I go save people? Uh, uh, flip a coin and make the decision. No, I'm not doing it. I can't, I'm not going to make it to the person on the hook. I'm not going to make it to the person on the hook. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe he picked them up finally. Okay. I didn't make it. Shit. Fuck that. I'm going. Everybody getting hooked. No, no, no. Normally I do. And you guys know for a fact that I normally I do. Uh-uh. Not today. Not today. I'm sorry, peeps. 
Not today. I need at least one win for the day. <laughs> okay. And then it gives me credit for this, right? Right? But anyway, so getting back to the RV thing, um, I was looking up prices of renting them and it's like anywhere from like 120 to $300 a night for just the RV itself. And then you have to pay like when you park it on a lot and hook up all this stuff, right? Cause you gotta hook up like the, um, water and and you know bathroom stuff and it ends up being like depending on on what kind of hotels you stay at you know what i mean when you go on a vacation it ends up being more if not the same as a hotel you know what i mean and it's kind of like kind of expensive but i would love to try it just one time because then if I love it, you know what I mean? Like, I'd rather just get my own. But then there's the added hassle of where am I going to park it? Because I live in the city and there's there's really no place for me to park it on the street. So I'd have to go rent a space somewhere to park it. Y you know what I mean? And it's just like, fuck, man. Fuck. That's why I like uh, my next house and I've been looking, I've been looking since before the pandemic. Um, my next house, I'm going to make sure that there is like plenty of space. Like it's not in the city. I don't want, I live in like what's considered a townhouse. All the houses are like connected together. Excuse me. So the next, the, if I move, it's going to be like, I want to be in the middle of the fucking woods. I just need gig internet and plenty of space where I could park and have like lots of space. That's, that's what I want. That's the dream right there. Have a goat. That's like my bucket list. That's one of my bucket list things is have a pet goat. That way I don't have to cut the fucking grass. A wild zangoose in the chat if you guys want to catch it. Oh God, I hate this map. I hate this fucking map. Oh my god, yes, a goat, yes. I want a goat so fucking badly. Where the hell is this glyph? God damn it. Excuse me, pardon me. Excellent. Did it make me? It does make me drop. Why does it make me drop my shit? Let go. I like. <laughs> well, we're off to a fantastic start. The fuck? Like, I wasn't even there working on the gen. I just happened to run by. I'm gonna kind of ignore the gens until I get my glyph thing done. <laughs> and literally, the only reason I want a pet goat is so I don't have to cut the grass. <laughs> That's the reason. Also, I think a pet goat is fucking cool. Ooh, I could do the glyph thing again? Let me cleanse this totem. You could just brag to everyone. No, I wouldn't brag. Running for my fucking life again. God, it's all straightaways too. Sir, sir, can you tell I'm on a mission to get glyphs, please? Oh God, he's a fucking chaser. Well. No, 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 
suck. I hate it when they do that. <laughs> Wiggle Ace, move your booty. That glyph is upstairs, right? Like, I gotta go in there and go up, I think? I'm so concerned about my glyphs. <laughs> I'm gonna clear out some of these redeems. Thank you. There was somebody, somebody did a hydrate. Rising, I think it was, did a hydrate. I just did it while I had the opportunity. Don't be lame. Oh my god, lame killer. I'm gonna go into second phase. you I think she got pulled up yes okay there's nobody on a hook right now all right let's get upstairs and get that glyph Commuting with the glyph. <laughs> Go up here. <laughs> because I feel like he's gonna come- Oh, there's the glyph thingy. Let's go to the other part of the glyph. And be done. And then I'm good with dying. I am good with dying at this point. Oh god, she's in the middle. I'm gonna take a chance. Saved your life. Oh my god, another freaking glyph? Like, how many of these- Oh, shit balls! <laughs> Shit balls. That's okay. I am good. I'm good. I got my glyph thingy done, I think, so... Yeah, I'm gonna die. It's okay, though. It's alright. I was a hero. I was a hero. Two, two, one person got to live a little bit longer because of me. And I got my win last time. Like, in the last game so i'm totally good with no more wins i mean it would it would suck if i got no more wins but i don't i don't want that to happen did it not give me credit oh i have to do it without rushing falling or being injured oh i did not read that very well so i can't sprint fall or get injured while I'm doing the glyph thing. Wow, that's fucking... That's fucking difficult. I don't know if I could do that. Well, shit. Thank you for the boop. I don't, I don't know if I can do that. Shit balls. I'm going to run an ad real quick so that way we don't have to do it in the middle of the game. It's got like five minutes before it's supposed to play. I'll just do it now. You do. Oh. 
Ouch, Jesus. Did you guys see the new thing that uh, Discord does now while you are uh, streaming? Uh, if you have uh, gotten to, to do the name change thing, if you, if you notice, um, people that are currently streaming, like you can only see like the first letter of my name in the, um, like if you look at your friends list and stuff like that. Yeah, I've seen that. Allegedly, it's supposed to help protect streamers um, so that if they don't, because, right, you wouldn't be friends with somebody that that's not, you know what I mean? Like, you wouldn't automatically friend somebody in two seconds of meeting them, right? Um, so the, I guess the idea behind it is, is it's to protect the streamers so that way they can't, like, see your name and like bombard you and shit like that so, something like that i remember reading like an article uh uh yesterday on reddit about it not yesterday the day before which also i think reddit is like doing like a protest right now like a lot of the um different things like different boards that i read are doing like a blackout for two days or something like that because they're going um they're like protesting against some changes on reddit or, or some something like that i'm i'm gonna be honest i don't i didn't really pay attention too much to it but i saw a bunch of announcements in a lot of the the subreddits that i particularly frequent because i like to read like the legal advice one for example um and they were there were people posting like the mods or whatever were posting that they're going to do like a blackout protesting against some sort of a change that they're doing um but yes yes Oh, the police station. Okay. So I've got to grab this and then take it without running where it needs to go. But how do I know where it needs to go? Please be outside somewhere, Glyph. And if I run, it's going to go away. Fuck. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> Luck was on my side. Obviously, if I have to run, I'm going to run, but I'm trying not to. I'm trying not to. Where the fuck is my glyph? Y'all keep your eyes peeled for this goddamn glyph. I think I heard it. Fuck me, man. Woo, no, that's that's it. Oh shit! Well, we're gonna have to start over with the glyph hunting. Ah! Fuck. Damn it! How the hell are you supposed to do that? Oh, there. Well, no, because I canceled it out now. So, of course, it's gonna be like visible for the first one. Fuck, though. This, 
I might have to change my my thing. I misread it initially because I thought it was just commune with white glyphs. I'm gonna try and see if I can do it though. Yo, y'all want to come down and help a bitch out, please? Wow, I thought he was up top. Can he jump down with a person? Didn't it look like he was up top? Well, I guess he could have run down the stairs too, but... I'm gonna take a chance. Damn. I'm not liking this <laughs> this at all. Yeah, go ahead and fix that gen, Billy Bill. Don't worry, don't worry about me fighting for my life here. Literally battling against the entity. Man, if he hits me, I'm dead. Run, bitch. <laughs> okay. Nope, 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 nope. Don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. A wild Dratini in the chat, y'all. A wild Dratini. I know that's a popular one. All right, here he comes, here he comes. Damn, he runs fucking fast. Do we try for the glyph? I mean... It's all right, quit your belly aching. Without falling too, without falling, dashing, or uh, getting injured. Is it? <laughs> this is awful. I can't dive off of there. I gotta actually walk. Man, we're good. <laughs> I'm gonna go through here first. I guess I'll open this to see if I can't heal myself or something. Oh, thank God. That 
was off. Wait, it didn't give me credit. Is it because I was injured? Son of a bitch. Or maybe I have to do it like I had to do it one more time. You know what I mean? Like I have to do it three times back to back without. God, I gotta read it again because I'm doing something wrong. So maybe. But I don't think I saw it after I got it that second time. I don't think it was there. Selecting this challenge generates a fragile white glyph. Take it to a dangerous place without rushing, falling, or being injured. And it says zero out of three. But it doesn't say that I have to do it in one shot. And that's why I chose this one, because there were some other ones where I had to do, like, multiple things in one game. And I was like, there's no way in hell. Like, I know I can't do that in one game. So that's why I went this route, because this one... Collect five memory shards, uh, generates memory shards. See, this one has to be completed in one trial. So for this one, I have to do five in one. And I thought for sure I couldn't do it, which is why I went down here because this one says three white glyphs, fragile white glyph, take it to a dangerous place without rushing, falling, or being injured. But it doesn't specify that it has to be done in one shot. And if I go this way, what happens if I go this way? I could do that, but then I have to do killer stuff. And this is a killer glyph challenge. So I could do, I could try that one, but then I have to do this. No, I don't, I don't want to play as a killer. That's why I went this route. Fuck me, man. I mean, we'll try it again. We'll try it again. I saw my shit, right? Yes. It's so tough not sprinting or falling or being injured. <laughs> I feel like that's how you play Dead by Daylight, is being injured the whole time. Oh, her hair looks so cute. I like Fang, uh, Fang Min with blue hair. And like the little Kit Kat beanie, I love it. Wait, is that... Why didn't it let me see two of them? Are they both killer ones? Interesting. I've seen it where it doesn't show you one, but not that it's ever not shown me two. That was weird. Too. Pay attention to other survivor status icons if they're injured, dying, or hooked. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh my goodness, game. Let's go. And see, and the thing I was talking about, the Discord thing, I'm in uh, streamer mode or whatever, right? But I can see everybody else who's already changed their name. They're showing up as like M dot 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 dot. And they're not streaming or A dot 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 dot. They're not streaming. You know what I mean? Which I think is a very interesting change. Well, I can run to this glyph. I can run to it.
That was fucking close. That was really fucking close. <laughs> Don't look in here. <laughs> no, 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 keep going. Nothing to see here. Okay, right, so I got the glyph. I did not run. Oh my fuck god! Are you serious? Cool. I feel like I'm going to be running in a second. I sure am. I am never going to get these fucking glitches done. Ever. <laughs> I need to find another player that I can dump this fucking dude on. God, fuck me, man. Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. What the fuck, man? That was the longest chase ever. There's my glyph. Good news. <laughs> Good news. It's right there. Oh, God. So close. Like, I could literally touch it. I could literally touch it right now. Andre, welcome Wouldn't in, New Sparkle. Chat. Mission? Andre, New Sparkle, New Sparkle. Chat. We don't save in DBD. Go ahead, heal me if you must. And now the game of not running. No running. No um, falling and no damage. Thank you. Oh my god, glyphs. You actually do save. You save other people. I do. I am a hero. Right now I'm being greedy though. I want only glyphs. There you go, baby girl. Ooh, okay. Only glyphs today. Hey, Jibs. <laughs> Thank you for the head pets. Fuck me! <laughs> Fuck me! Son of a bitch, man. I gotta start the glyph thing all over again now! Fuck it, I'm not doing this glyph thing. Not doing it. How are you, Fire? I'm doing good. Thank you. Thank you. How are you? I feel like I need like another weekend for my weekend. Doing okay? Good. Good. I, uh, I had some kittens and a mama cat 
that moved into my yard like about a week ago, week and a half ago, something like that. And uh, this weekend, I spent the weekend catching them and getting them rehomed. Or I should say, getting them to a... Getting them to a, uh, a no-kill shelter so they could be, you know, adopted out and stuff, taken care of. There's a cat around here. She has three kittens. I don't know if y'all have, like, no-kill shelters where you're at and if you feel like giving up the time. Um, then, by all means, definitely catch them, find a shelter, take them somewhere. It made my heart so freaking happy. It really did. It was so fulfilling, like, especially when I got to see them reunited. That explains why we never see any more kitty pics. <laughs> no, no, no. I still have my cat. Like, my personal cat still is in my house. But I had a cat, like a random stray. Son of a bitch, man. Uh, I had a random stray show up. Post cat pics. It's not my cat. I don't have pics. <coughs> Y'all need to concentrate on fucking healing. Fuck, we're gonna die. I'm sorry, y'all. You're on your own. Oh, no! <laughs> no! Fuck! Start crawling towards the door. Start crawling towards the door. I'm a crawl. I'm a crawl. I remember where the door is. I'm just gonna start crawling, see if I can make it. <laughs> maybe I can, maybe I can't. But I'm gonna fucking try. Fire remembers being a baby. Um, but anyway, so, yeah, uh, somebody... And the cat is chipped. The cat was chipped. Um... So somebody threw her out either because she was pregnant or or what. And uh I'm gonna sh I'm gonna laugh my fucking ass off if I make it out. I'm getting there. Fuck Look how far I made it. He should have let me out because I was so close. No! Aw, oh, damn. That would have been so good. Don't be slapping me, you biatch. That's quite toxic what you're doing, sir. Thank you for the host, Jibs. So who we got today? Thomas Thomas! Fesmo! Thomas Thomas! His parents must have hated him! Seriously! <laughs> he should have let you out cause just cause you're just such a pretty lady and so cool too? Nah. Nah. You should have let me go because I crawled really effing far. I was fighting for my life. Like, really fighting for my life. I'm gonna try the glyph thing one more time, and then if, if, if it's, like, not feasible or I don't get credit for at least one of the glyph, like, turn-ins or something... I'm going to just go to a different tome and try to, to get it. And then once I'm more comfortable with killers, maybe then I'll attempt like a killer run. 
Although I suppose I could just go kill her and just concentrate on the glyphs and let the players get out. Like, you, you know what I mean? Like, I could do that. But I don't want to because I'm not I'm not really like good with killer and I want to give it like an actual go. So fire, are you going to meld together with Nick Cage? What do you mean by meld together? Like face off, put his face on my character and put my face on him like that. Is that what you mean? Is that what you mean by meld? <laughs> Are you going to become one with the cage? Of course I am, but I think he's going to be a killer, isn't he? Isn't that what they announced? Yeah, I don't know either. I think they did say he was going to be... I don't know. I don't remember. I don't remember. Yo, y'all, I have a massive fucking headache. <laughs> I don't know why I hydrated a lot today and I know y'all are about to make me hydrate. I got it ready, but just, I don't know if it's just from the stress of all this stuff I've been doing and just like this weekend was very fucking busy for me. Not only was I catching kitties, but I also did like a lot of like, thank you, called it. Thank you for the hydrate. I also did a lot of like other work stuff like in the house and like a list of like I had a list of like 40 something things to do. All I know is that he wants you to know that whatever you play as him, you're actually him for real and that you need to know that the both of you are one and the same. <laughs> oh my God. You know who I would love to see? Do you know who and what I would love to see in this game? I would love to see Keanu Reeves, like from The Matrix, so Neo, and Agent Smith as like the killer. And maybe like Trinity as another player. All right, now I got to stop sprinting and I can't fall and I can't get hit. And somehow I have to find the goddamn glyph. Ooh, there it is. There it is. Um, but I think that would be fucking amazing, wouldn't it? All right. It didn't give me credit for it. So we need to find a glyph one more time. So no running, no sprinting, no falling. We're looking for a glyph. I just saw the killer. I saw the killer. But now that you said it, I really wish we had a horror movie where Keanu is the murderer. See, and you know what? Here's the thing. If Keanu ever played like a bad guy, Everybody would be confused. Does that count? Like I did the glyph thing three times now. Do I have to do it again? Yeah, exactly. Yes. Like, God, I want to fucking sprint so bad. I want to sprint so damn bad. I saw the killer invisible. All right, we did it four times now. This is the fourth time we're communing with the glyph. How many fucking times? It's not giving me credit. Make some noise. Whoop whoop. I did it. I did it four times now. Oh, 
and it didn't give me credit. Well, fuck this. I'm not doing that then. I've gone gone above and beyond. Above and beyond with the whole glyph thing. Well, I'm going to go ahead and bolt. I don't feel comfortable. I don't feel comfortable. See, and there's the fucking glyph again now. Do we see it anywhere? Fuck me. He's invisible now. That progged something on the top right. Did it? Did it say it was done? Like, did you see like one out of one, one out of three or something? Because if it did proc something, then I then I got credit for it. I fucking hope. Because if I have to do that shit that many times, uh-uh. How many do we have left? Two? done oh god he's right here at least I thought he was right there see there's the fucking glyph again man That thing is really fucking irritating me. He must have the no. Hey, Pepsi, how are ya? Happy Monday to you. Oh my god, I just started singing that in the tune of Happy Birthday. I am so hey, sorry. Listen. No, you listen. Well, I'm just gonna fucking assume it. Assume I got it. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was very cringy. Oh, well, we're not going to this door. <laughs> oh, maybe we are. Maybe we are. I'm gonna watch and see what happens with this dude first. happening he's like right here isn't he but there's my goddamn glyph again jesus christ i swear to god real winners leave no 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 we're gonna wait we're gonna wait we got some time we got some time I feel like the killer's standing right- because he opened the door, didn't he? Okay, everybody's out. <laughs> oh, God. I should see now if I got credit for the glyph thing, because if I did, then I have to do it like four fucking times. Even though it says commune with three. No, I didn't get it. I didn't get it. 
I don't know how the hell to do this. And I'm doing what it said. I got to read it. Let's read it one more fucking time. <laughs> one more time. And then we'll decide what I'm doing wrong. All right, let's go back. Let's choose our thing. Okay, select challenge. Okay. All right. It says commune with three white glyphs. Selecting this challenge generates a fragile white glyph. Take it to a dangerous place without rushing, falling, or being injured. Okay, I did that four times in a row before I was like, fuck this, I'm not doing it anymore. We'll do, we'll do it one more time so you guys can fucking witness it. I'm telling you, something's wrong with this. It's not, it's not doing it. Where's the dangerous place? I don't know. I don't, you know what? That's a good point, Janella. That's a valid point. You have to take it somewhere. Well, I assumed that I just had to go to the next glyph. Do I have to take it maybe to the, ooh, I don't want to Google it and figure it out. Do I have to take it to like the hooks? That's the only dangerous place that I could think of that's in the, in the game, right? So maybe I have to take it to, to a hook? I thought I just had to like grab it and then talk and then grab the next one and then just grab. Okay. All right. We'll try it. We'll try Janela. If that's what it is, good fucking catch. Now you are the killer's fire. I'm not a killer. I'm not a killer. I swear to God, if it was something as easy as that, that I just kept missing over and over and over again, I'm going to be so upset with myself. So upset with myself. <laughs> I'm sitting here getting all kinds of heated and frustrated. And it's because like, I literally cannot read comprehend like my comprehension. Did you guys notice that when you're streaming, like you'll be reading stuff because you know, you're reading something to chat and you just don't fucking comprehend what you're reading at all. Thank you for the boop. A wild electric in the chat. Yeah, right? Like you could be doing story stuff and you don't fucking remember. Like Final Fantasy? I fucking forgot already what's going on in there right now. Oh no, wait, no, I remember. Thank you for the meows. Guilty as charged. <laughs> like, oh, like it's, it's so bad. <laughs> How are you, May? Happy Monday. I mean, shit, at this point, it's Tuesday, right? I'm all right. How are you? Good, good. I'm good. I'm good. I had a very stressful weekend catching kittens over the weekend. Wait, what? Wait, what, what? I said hello to May. <laughs> I heard about that. You need some help with the aloe? <laughs> yes, please. You said it was Tuesday and I was concerned. Well, I mean, it's like Monday night. We might as well call it Tuesday at this point, right? I legit looked at my calendar. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, so let's find one of these gosh darn glyphs. Look at that. There's one. Nope, 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 nope. Fuck, he sees me? <laughs> oh shit, I literally ran in front of him. He probably didn't see me. And I just panicked and made it 25 times more worse than it needed to be. Oh my god, that was the best! That was horrible. Stop fucking chasing me! <laughs> I was so focused on that goddamn glyph. Like, I just tunneled on that glyph, so I mean, at least now I know where there's a hook nearby. 
You totally could have maybe gotten away until you wanted to run hand in hand with him. I know, I like literally like brushed my fingers against his hand. Literally. <laughs> and you know what? I should have just stayed down in the bushes. He probably didn't even see me. I wish, I wish if he was streaming that I could like real quick see what he was doing. See what that looked like on his screen. I got the glyph. I need a hook. There's one. We'll just take our time. Get over there nice and easy like. You totally could have maybe, just maybe, maybe. What the? Is it because I'm injured? It might be because I'm injured, because I can't be injured, right? Uh, possibly, possibly. You totally could have made, because uh, it says you need to get them without rushing, falling, or getting hurt. Oh, yes, yes, I know, yep. And I'm hurt right now, so I think uh, that's why I lost it. The one that I literally just got. Like, literally just got. And didn't run anywhere. There you go, Dude, Mr. this fucking sucks, this one. Thank you for the head pets. This tome is terrible. Like, or this particular, um, task. Thank you, boo. What? This is fine. This is fine. This is, this is totally fine. I have been disconnected. Why did I disconnect? What the hell? The killer? It says I did. That's interesting. You can still hear me, right? Like, I'm still live, right? Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. The game heard me. It knew I had a plan and it was like, no, we're not letting this bitch get it. That's what happened. That was like fucking. See, they're already putting Neo and Agent Smith into the game, into one of the next like little DLC things. And Agent Smith just fucking wrecked me just now. You guys were all witness to it. I want that so bad. I want Neo and like a Matrix thing added into here so fucking bad. So bad. Thank you for the boop. Could you imagine like how amazing would that be? It could be cool. Yeah, I would want it. You know that one scene um, where it's the lady in the red dress in like New York City and, and stuff like I would want that to be the seat. I'm going to write a very strongly worded letter to the developers of Dead by Daylight and I'm going to pitch the shit out of that. I'm also going to start one of those signature things. You know what I'm talking about? Where like people are like pissed off about something and they start like a signature. What the what the hell is that shit called? Um, you, you know what I'm talking about? Like petition. That's the word petition. I'm going to start a petition and um, we're going to send that to the devs. I'm not even kidding. I'm literally writing this down. Petition for Matrix in D B D. And then Y scene. Agent Smith as the killer. I want this to be like a DLC expansion. Uh Neo as a survivor. How many survivors are usually in a pack? Like three in the DLC? Like, isn't it usually one killer and like three survivors? Ooh, I want Tank. I would want Tank. Tank was one of my favorite characters in the Matrix. I can run right now.
It's not the hook. What else would be considered a dangerous place? The main building? The basement of the main building, maybe? I heard something down here. Like, it almost sounds like the hatch. I don't know if you guys can hear it or not. Over the dude screaming. Hold on. It, it was really pronounced over here, Kupo. Hey, Orion. Thank you, Kupo. Thank you for the hydrate, Kupo. Oh, see, I don't hear it anymore. Fuck, Kupo. Wouldn't now be a good time to save your mission? But I still have the glyph, right? Damn it. Does anybody else have any ideas of where it could be that I have to take this white glyph, Kupos? Because we tried a hook and it, it wouldn't let me do anything at the hook. And as far as I can tell, I still have the glyph on me. Which actually, I don't know what that icon is on the bottom left there. It's like a broken mirror or something, Koopos. I don't see anything here anywhere where I can deposit the glyph. I think you need to take it to the basement. Is this not the basement? Or is there, like, lower than this? Because if there's lower than this, like, damn. Basement is the one with four hooks. Right, but where is that? <laughs> the basement is usually known as the place one way in. Four hooks. Okay. But isn't that always in the main building? Isn't this the main building? But I guess I can't go any lower than this. I guess this is as low as I could go. Pangus! What's Pangus? Well... See, that just canceled out my glyph just now because I fell. Which is fine. Because we need to find the uh, fucking basement. And I need to find the damn glyph anyway. Oh, there it is. Yeah. I recommend finding the basement first, then the glyph. Okay. <laughs> I just came in. Tap!
Uh, maybe here. Maybe here. Yes! Yes! That was close. I could have fallen. We did it! Oh my god, there it is! Oh, we figured it out, guys. Thank you so much for your assistance there. Alright, so I got credit for one. All right, fuck, man. Fuck, that was a pain there in the cool, ass. Thank you for the head pets. <laughs> Teamwork makes the dream work. Oh. <laughs> Is he shaking his head no at me? Oh, oh la, 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 la. Are you fucking camping? You're being kind of shitty. He is being kind of shitty. Wow, that's fucked. He said no? That's shitty! That is so shitty! <laughs> like... I don't even know what the fuck to do with that! Like, there's no way I can save her. Like, he's literally right there. That's so shitty. I mean, fine. I'll fucking repair Jen's then. That's such shit. It sure is. That's so rude. And there's literally nothing I can do. Like, go ahead. Run. Try and save her, guys. He's literally right there. Maybe he has a challenge where he has to kill one person or something and then he's going to let him go. Like, let everybody else go. See, he's killing them. I ran off like he told me to. I don't like that at all, though. Like, I really, really don't fucking like that. And he let that person go. I don't understand. Let me get it, let me get it, let me get it! Let me get it. Thank you, I guess. I don't know what the... F oh god, are you chasing me though? Oh, alright. Okay, <laughs> whatever. Whatever floats your boat, sir. Let me heal you. We're gonna go in just a second, just a second. I'd like as many points as possible. All right, let's go. Thank you, thank you. I guess. <laughs> I wonder, like, what the deal was with that particular player. Like, I hope they were friends or something. You know what I mean? Like, because I don't know. I don't fucking know. I don't understand people. I had two. Yes, I won, but... But, you know what I mean? He camped somebody. I don't know the circumstances, but there whatever. Go, baby girl. 
Thank you for the head pets and the boop. I very much appreciate. The killer sold just one for the kill. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's pretty much what he did. He just took one soul and let the rest of us go. And he legitimately let the rest of us go, right? Like, because he was literally running around us, not hurting us at all. So whatever, whatever. You know what? We're going to add this since I'm doing this glyph thing so I could see the aura of the hooks in the basement. Tremendously increases. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. That was the wrong one. Wrong one. Reveals the aura of the basement hooks to you for 20 seconds. Okay. All right. I mean, I don't want to spawn in the basement, but I do want to know where the the where the basement is just to make my fucking life easier. That's the same one I have on right now. I guess I guess that's what we're going to take. Whatever, whatever. <laughs> oh goodness. We're almost done with Ace. We're level 40 and then we're going to prestige three and then I'm done. And then I'm done with him because I need one of his skills to be level three for that um, slippery meat build that I'm working on. So we've got 10 more levels and a prestige and then we're done. And we've got all the pieces, all the pieces. That's fucking exciting, man. I worked so long and hard. Oh shit, there's an ad in eight minutes. Fuck. I'm gonna snooze it twice real quick so that way it won't... <laughs> it won't in the middle of the game because games aren't more than like what five ten minutes maybe all right show me okay there, there's the basement right there how do you know when ads happen um if you have your twitch thingy up there's two different ways there's um there's a bot like if you use streamer bot Nutty wrote a uh, plugin that will show you, like it shows you a little hot bar letting you know. Uh, that's one way. And the other way is if you have your streamer dashboard uh, open. I tried using that the bot before and it didn't work for me. Yeah, I don't, I personally don't like it. Uh, I don't like the appearance of it. It's very, like, not appealing to me. Oh, I can't pick up the tool thing when I'm doing this. See, because it canceled out me having the, uh, the glyph. Okay, so that's another mistake I was making. I need to grab the glyph and fucking go. No playing around. Like, grab, go. They're taking that person right to the basement. Which is shitty as that is, it's actually fucking helpful because now I know where the where the things are because I forgot already. Okay, she's right there. Gosh. I gotta do this without fucking running. I'm sorry. There you go, baby girl. Fuck, oh, please don't hit me while I do this. Please don't hit me while I do this. Okay. 
fuck me? This is fine. We did it. We did it. We got the fucking glyph. That's all that we needed. <laughs> I'm totally cool dying. I'm gonna restart my game after this because I'm assuming that's my um, bars over there above my character there. Like not the tick marks, but like above. I wish I could. <laughs> I wish I could show you a little bit better. But you know what I'm talking about in the top left above my name and and where I'm hooked. I only have one bar. Apparently. But like my streamer, my stream connection is totally fine. So I'm going to try re resetting my game real fast to see if that helps. Killer throwing everybody in the basement. Everybody. As long as I get credit for that fucking glyph this just that that one that time just now, that's all that matters to me right now. I don't care if I win or lose this game now. And I need to do it one more time. One more time and then I'm finally fucking done. God, that was that was a task that literally was ridiculous for the longest time. Like that just took forever to figure it out. I'm not saving nobody. <laughs> Crazy Ralph's gonna have to go save a person or two. We need to get some goddamn gens done. Oh, a demo cat's dead. I almost fucked that up. HUD fam Chris is gonna die. God, I just don't want people to needlessly die. it yeah that's it that's game we're done <laughs> okay i should have not tried to save them every single time i'm like huh? every single time i try to save people this happens but that's okay i got my glyph i'm sorry guys Do, do, do. What time is it? So, you know you're an adult when I bought a scrubby brush on Amazon because I need to, like, wash the grout in my kitchen. And I bought one of those, like, electric scrubby brushes. <laughs> uh, you know what? Five out of five. I'm going to exit all the way out. And then jump back in because I don't want to get booted again from another game. I'm also going to run the ad now so we can get that done because we do have an ad in six minutes. Uh, all right, let me exit out. Quit. Okay, okay. All right. I'm going to give it a second. I'm going to check my internet. Yep, totally fine. Just like I knew it was. All right, and we're going to hop back into DBD. And hopefully have it loaded back up before the ad is over for those people that are stuck in an ad. Speaking of ads, ads have gotten really fucking aggressive on Twitch, haven't they? Like, they've been extreme. So I was in, I was watching somebody stream earlier today 
And I just, I just followed them. I, I, I haven't, they haven't hit affiliate yet. They don't have, you know what I mean? So they don't, they don't have the option to subscribe to them or anything. Um, but there was ads like crazy amounts of ads and it wasn't, it wasn't the, um, the kind that take up the whole screen. It was like, it made the stream smaller and it was like a banner at the bottom, but it was like literally, and I watched it just to see the time. And it was like literally every fucking 20 minutes. And that's kind of a little ridiculous. That's pretty fucking aggressive. Don't you think? Like, especially for like that this particular person was not, they're not affiliate. So they they have no choice how their shit runs, right? Like it's my understanding, um, like non-affiliates, non-partners, you have no control over your uh over how your uh ads run right like that's that's a quote-unquote perk of being an affiliate and up is that you can control if you're doing like pre-roll ads and stuff yeah that is a lot it was fucking aggressive as hell and um but like i said it wasn't it wasn't the one that like takes over the stream it was the kind that just like make the the stream like get a little bit smaller and it's like a banner at the bottom but still even if that's all it was like i still feel like that's pretty fucking aggressive i'm gonna try what's tomorrow tomorrow's tuesday so i work from home tomorrow too and tomorrow shouldn't be that busy of a day. oh no actually it is gonna be a super busy day because tomorrow's uh water termination day so we're gonna get fucking bamboozled with phone calls like like fucking swamped with phone calls um but they usually don't start shutting off until after lunchtime but in the morning i'm gonna try and find like a couple because i like to go check out people that aren't affiliate yet as silly as that sounds because i'm hoping that maybe me lurking or dropping a follow helps push them over that edge you know what i mean so i really like checking out people that aren't affiliate yet for that reason but anywho tomorrow helping people reach it is so nice it is it really is i love like going and i i always visit those people a second and third time just to see if it happened to not necessarily me specifically push them over the edge but if within the last couple of days of me visiting if it made them hit the goal somehow like even if it was me if it was somebody else whatever but anywho so i'm gonna be watching this specific person again tomorrow um and I'm going to I'm going to time the ads uh, and see it again, because I'm again, I was timing it today, but I was like really busy with work, too. And I wasn't really like hardcore timing it. But I want to like set a timer on my phone. You know what I mean? Like or like I'm running and hit lap every single time I see the ad pop up. So that way I could get like an average to see what it is, because it was it was fucking awful. <laughs> It was awful. And I know for sure, because they weren't even live an hour yet. And I had seen it three times for sure. So I kind of didn't really count that first one because like maybe that first one was the quote unquote pre-roll. But the pre-roll ad is like a big ass ad. You know what I mean? Like it's the one that takes over the whole damn screen. That's your pre-roll. Excuse me, ma'am. I've got a glyph in a basement to get to. I hate pre-rolls so much. Me too. Me too. I just hate ads in general. Ads in general are just a pain in the ass. When I get to the basement. Is it over here? Did the killer just run by me? Shit, y'all, where's the basement here? The 
the killer really did walk right by me. Oh, didn't even fucking see me. I'm pretty sure it's the grudge one. Or maybe it's this building over here. And I'm just blind. It is the grudge one. Man, she totally... It's not fucking here. Girl, I can't run to you. I'm sorry. I can't even grab you and run. Like, I gotta grab you and... And go. The fuck is the basement? I mean, it don't matter. I gotta find the fucking glyph again, but... Okay, it's right there. Thank you for the- Ooh. My lord. <laughs> Where the fuck is the basement? Go ahead, heal me, heal me. I'm sorry, I'm moved. Thank you for the heal. Thank you. How am I so blind and unable to find this fucking basement? Maybe it's over there? God, all we're doing is just healing every- Maybe it's in that tent. That was a great skill check. Ma'am, I need you the fuck out of my way. Jesus, ball sacks, man. There it is. Jesus, that was fucking difficult to find. Oh, we did it. Finally. We don't have to fucking do any more of those. All right. On to fucking whatchamacallits generators. Here's one excellent. Oh, God, that was a fucking tough one. Hit <laughs> the shit shit. <laughs> I kind of saw it at the last second. Damn. This is fun. I got my um, task complete, so that's A-OK -okay with me. Don't you take me to that basement. Ugh.
That's how I'm gonna find it next time, is I'm just gonna let the killer hit me and take me to the basement instead of me searching for it aimlessly for like 10 minutes. Good lord. <laughs> Am I out of coffee? Did I drink it all? Oh no. Sad face. Sad face. Excuse me, pardon me. <laughs> ooh, ooh, hello, hello. Am I trapped? Kind of. Where are you taking her? Where are you taking her? Are you taking her to the basement? Oh, there's a hook right there. Oh, Maury? Did she just kill her killer? <gasps> she did. That was a Maury. I think they're teleporting, like using a TV to teleport right now. Maybe? No. Alright, this killer is out for our blood. Like, really out for our blood. That one's done. Jen, 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 Jen. This time we know if we see like the TV signal bars, we're gonna run like the static for a television. We're gonna run right away. This game is so fucking stressful. <laughs> oh, I gotta do the thing. Like the videotape thing, right? I forgot about that. Hopefully I can get this done and then grab it and, and go. See, there is a videotape thing that I have to do. I doubt that she like just dropped on me like that, luckily. Or maybe she did, who knows? No. That gen was almost done, too. Go grab our friend over there. Yeah, I think that's what I'm fucking up, is I'm not doing the thing where I run to a TV, grab a tape, and run to another TV. The player, she's still there. I think where she got killed right there. Shit, I thought it got rid of your body when you died. But I never really paid attention when somebody got morried. Thank you, ma'am. You saved my life. Come here, let's heal. Where'd you go? Heal, 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 heal. We gotta do the videotape, boo. Son of a bitch! This is fine. I'm gonna boost my... I'm gonna boost my, um, 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 thingy. Don't pick me up! Don't pick me up! Chase him, chase him, chase him! Yeah, yeah, yeah! I'm gonna keep doing my recovery. 
Hopefully somebody can pick me up. Not you. I don't want you to pick me up. Okay, good, good. I'm almost done. I'm almost fully recovered. I gotta go find a TV and do the TV thing. Or else she's just gonna keep dropping on top of me. Run, bitch, run. Ah, much better. Much better, muy bien. Fuck, I'm starting a gen from the beginning. This is fine, this is fine. Am I by an exit? Oh, that's fucking beautiful. Do 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 do. We getting there. We getting there. I don't think the other people know about the tape thing. Cause average Slinky's got like five bars. To be honest, I completely forgot about. It. I don't see that killer very very often. No, Slinky! I'm gonna finish this gen though, because we need we need this one and one more. Badly. A Geo dude in the chat. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Get the other person up, get him up, get him up. Oh no, I'm getting morried. That's fine, I haven't seen this one, I don't think. Oh, that is fucking brutal. Oh, I have seen this one. Yo, that's awesome. I like that, Mori. <laughs> And we finally got our fucking challenge done. Finally. <laughs> that was a creepy Mori. Like with the eye. That's probably one of the creepiest ones I've seen. The other ones are pretty like gory. Right? Like Ghostface. Doesn't Ghostface do the one with its uh, the selfie? Have you watched a Ring movie? I have. And actually I refuse to watch it. And uh, I'm going to tell you why. I think if I remember correctly, we planned we're going to do this one. And then we're doing this one. Right? Because this is a killer challenge. Yeah. So we're going to go up. And then, because eventually I'll earn 100,000 blood points. And then stun the killer. Yeah. I think that's the way we, we decided we were going to go. Um... I did watch it, but I refuse to watch it again uh, because when I first watched it, this is, good, this is horrible. When I first watched it, um, I watched it with my ex-husband and then like he fucked with me for a while with that. Like he would make the noises. Hey, Ed Reaper for a while and like kind of gaslit me a little bit a lot of bit into me imagining it reaper holy shit we're on the verge of having a toddler reaper thank you 
Is it not hunting because we have head cams? Ooh, Phasmo, Phasmo. <laughs> no. That must be it. <laughs> we have she head cams on. Now it's like, you know. Oh, oh, uh -oh. oh Where? shit. Where? 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 Right here. Oh, it's really hunting. <laughs> Wait. Actually hunting? The door was open. <laughs> you okay really coming did. soon? What? Why? Whoa, shit, we Oh, shit. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Holy oh, shit, oh, Reaper. <laughs> I love that. When's it? When's the new update? And I think they're doing stuff like to kind of compete with Gemologist, right? That's a whole crazy clip. Yeah, it looked crazy. Is it next month already? Damn. I might have to put um, what you call it, Demonologist, to the side for a little bit. I've heard better too. Nice. Nice. That's exciting. I kind of tucked Phasmo away because I got like very much into demonologist. I like Phasmo a lot more. Do you? Do you? I haven't had the opportunity to play multiplayer on demonologist, but like in terms of solo gameplay, personally, I find demonologist more entertaining. Um, but Phasmo, I find it to be more fun with friends. Oh, look at them with their cute little... Look, everybody's doing Christmas outfits. I don't have any Christmas gear, though. Do I? Customize. I don't have any Christmas outfits. I don't. I'm sorry, guys. I can change this to something different. Uh, let's do this. Okay. Okay. Uh, but it is a one of a time thing when you think about it. But it is a one time thing when you think about it. What do you mean a one time thing? I'm confuzzled. My God, these guys are gonna stick. Wait, that's it. That's Ace. Look at how different his Ace looks compared to my Ace. So different. Like dramatically different, I even. Demon is it's scripted. So some of it is scripted, not all of it. Like there's some, there's some, some of this stuff happens like no matter what, but then there's some, at least it's my understanding that's like individualized, I guess. Doing better each day. Oh yeah. I hope you're doing well. I saw your your thing. I'm sorry. Thing? Oh yeah. Reaper had a thing. That's all I'm gonna say about that. That's it. Just that. A ting. A ting. Uh, not really. People are getting the same jump scares in the same places now, too. Maybe I haven't played it enough, but there there is some. There is some that for sure, 100% of the time, I'll tell like, I'll even expect it. Uh, I think I even have a clip floating out there somewhere, too, where, like, the chair slides across the room, and I'm like, Jesus, this has happened so many times. And you would think that at this point I wouldn't get jump scared from it because this specific thing happens a lot. But maybe it's because I haven't played as much as some people that some of them are still, like, relatively new to me. Maybe. I forgot what my freaking task is now. Shit. Wow, he got three people right off the bat with that. That's the doctor, right? Fuck, man. Yeah. Yeah, maybe maybe that's what. Because I only play it when I stream it. I haven't played it, like, on my own. So I'm not, like, beating the crap out of it. it, it you know what I mean? And I think I've only played it four or five times. So not not that much you, you know what i mean compared to some people that are that are, you know what i mean like they're playing every day all day so there's a lot yet that's still pretty new to me do, do. 
Ooh, am I gonna get this done with no interruptions? Oh, I have to do great skill checks. Isn't that what I need? I need 18 great skill checks. Maybe. I have depleted my toolbox. Excellent work. I was chasing the other ace. Excellent. Oh, what am I walking for? I don't have fucking glyphs to go after. They got the shitter one already, right? This one's done. What are we doing? Oh, he wants... Okay. I understand the assignment now. It's going to be that kind of a game. I got one for you up here. I've got another one for you right there. Where's where'd that Jingo? I mean, there's one right here. Do do. Oof. I don't like that. There's a pallet there for the killer. Are the games sweaty tonight? Mm, it's kind of, kind of off and on. Like, uh, mm, I had one they were farming. I had one where they killed one person and one person only. And then, um, and they let the rest of us go, so I don't know if they need it. This one's farming blood points, obviously, or farming pallets specifically. So, yo, fire. Hey, Hansu, how are you? I recognize you from um, Shiro's stream. Son of a bitch. I'm good, good. I'm glad. Happy to hear it. Happy to hear it. Are you on um, on that side of the world as well? Me, only sweaty people. Are you playing like right, uh, uh, like today, have you played? I don't know, Reaper, there's been some days where it's just literally like fucking sweat, 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 right? Like I had one game uh, today where they literally chased me like at least for 60 seconds like that's just fucking batshit crazy to me like i've played as a killer too i do have to get eight of them eight great skill checks okay um chasing me for that long just seems like really fucking ridiculous you know what i mean but that's my personal opinion does that make somebody sweaty not necessarily I think it is a little ridiculous, though. Oh, come here, Mr. Killer Man. Here's a, here's a pallet. Um, oh, here's another one. I'm just going to keep hitting them all for him. Are you going to do me a solid and not kill me? And let me get out. Oh, fuck. Here, here. Here's another pallet. Enjoy your pallets, sir. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah. He's definitely farming pallets. Nice. Uh, the new updates hurts the camper killers a lot, too. Good. Good. That is the only thing in this game that literally drives me fucking insane. 
Anyways, I was just passing by since it's 3 a.m. Good luck with your stream fire. Thank you so much for popping in, Hansu. I very much appreciate it. Very much appreciate it. I was just gonna say, I, I was asking earlier if you're like in the same neck of the woods as like as Shiro, where you're like five, six, seven hours ahead or something, and and you are. Thank you so much for popping in. I very much appreciate it. <laughs> and have a good sleep, man, when you go. Or ma'am. Man, ma'am. Person. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay, so I gotta get, like, uh, six more great skill checks. And then that task is done. And we're at, like, 43. We're getting there. We're getting there. I gotta read up on the on the the notes for the um, thing tomorrow for the update. Um, I know I read it before and somebody told me, but my memory lately has just been fucking hot garbage, and I don't remember what the update what the thing is that they're putting in place to help with the uh, camping stuff to help um, make that stop. Look at these guys. Twinsies! I can't remember for the life of me what it was. That's fine. We'll leave our stuff like this. Do, 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 do. Slows down stuff, I think. Uh, is it... Slows down... What do you mean slows down stuff? I thought I had it, but as I started to say it, it fucking left my brain. I really think they should do a perimeter thing where, like, uh, <laughs> if somebody gets hooked, like, the killer can't be in there. Or at least they can't slash at people while they're in there. Or they take some sort of penalty. Some sort of penalty. There is a penalty, isn't there? Some sort of a penalty happening. hundred percent bonus to blood points to all players yes in all categories love it love it a wild shinks i never really appreciated shinks until i played arceus and then i very much started appreciating shinks i have to get back to pokemon to arceus <laughs> to violet to scarlet to fucking, um, what's the other one? Temtem? I know that's not Pokemon, but let's, let's be honest, y'all. It's Pokemon, just a different name. Um, and what the hell is the other one? Um, there's one other one. There's a, there's a game coming out on Steam and it's, it's so much like Pokemon. Like it's another rip off off of Pokemon. But it's one that I'm, like, super interested in. I can't remember what the fuck it's called, though. I have it on my wish list. It's, um, it's like a... Excuse me. It's something like a... Something pets. So, something like that. I can't remember now. But it added a whole lot of new, like, different... Like, I guess mechanics is the word I'm looking for to the game. Fuck. I need great skill checks. Come on. But I'm like super excited for that. Whoops. You know what? My child needs me to open the door. She just messaged me. So hold hold on while I find some place to hide. This works. I'll be right back. Hold on one second. Okay, my apologies. Let me text her back so she knows. Do do. It's raining, so I I told her to message me when she uh comes back home, so she's not standing out in the rain. 
Uh, should I yell at you for finish what you have first, or no? What do I have to finish first? Besides the Final Fantasy 6.4 stuff. One second later. Well, shit, that was fast. Yeah, the door is literally... The mudroom is right behind me. It's mudroom office. <laughs> The other Pokemon like games that you said you have to finish, like Arceus, Temtem, which ones? <laughs> you need to you need to give me a little more. So honestly, if I'm gonna finish anything, Arceus needs to be the first one I finish because. Whoa! I didn't see him. Fuck me! Yeah, all of those. Yeah, I have a couple to finish. I have a couple to finish. Although, Arce- or not Arceus, Temtem, I want to reset. I want to start over with Temtem because I've done so much and I don't remember the areas that I've been because I, um... Oh, this works out so fucking nicely! Thank you, killer! Thank you! <laughs> um, I don't remember what I've done, but I'm afraid to reset it because I'm afraid I'm going to lose some items that were like, uh, um, from like playing in, 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 um, when it was, whatchamacallit, a or early access. Uh, my stuttering is really fucking bad today. Oh God. There's the killer. <laughs> I'm so sorry you wasted your time healing me, sir. Oh, right next to a hook, too. You're welcome, Mr. Killer Man. I remember you playing that. Yeah, that was probably the craziest stream that I ever had. I had, um, I think it was 54 or 52 was my, like, average viewer. <laughs> or not average viewer. Well, I mean, it was pretty fucking high. But, like, that was, like, consistently I had, like, 50-something for a while. It was fucking crazy. But that was the day that it came out, you know. Holt following for it. Yes, exactly. Ew, you're kind of campy, sir. We're gonna take another chance. Fuck out. I was not expecting that, but it happened, and we're happy. Did you just what? I did. I just fucking looped and looped right off of that. Son of a bitch. That's so lucky. <laughs> I'm actually working on a slippery me build, which is why I'm playing uh, this character specifically, uh, because I need one of his perks to be at level three. I can't save that other person. But I could save you. Nick Cage out yet? Nope. Nope, nope. Hey, Negatron. Happy Monday to you. Again, I'm fucking singing it like freaking um, happy birthday. What the fuck is wrong with me? Howdy fire. Howdy, howdy. Well, I'm not saving any more people. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done being a hero. I want to survive. You just happy. I am happy. Um, I had kittens. I'm going to I'm going to repeat this story until the day I die. So I had um, not me personally had kittens like I did not birth kittens, but uh, somebody. So it's kind of a sad story, but a happy story, too. Uh, somebody dumped a cat in our yard, not specifically in my yard, but in in the area around my yard. And uh, what ended up happening was uh, Mama Kitty had kittens. 
New kids, wait, what? No, 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 no. Fire's tubes are tied. Fire cannot have more babies. Fire learned her fucking lesson. With babies. Come here, let's heal up, boo. Um laughs in parent. Yeah, I'm a I'm a parent too. <laughs> but um anywho, so um the mama cat had five kittens and they started living uh under my porch go ahead heal me heal me heal me thank you thank you thank you and uh we found them and we started feeding them and stuff and we were kind of looking to see if somebody owned the cat which very clearly somebody did they they fucking just dumped her um but anywho uh yesterday we got the yesterday and the day before because it took two days for us to catch them all um they're in a in a shelter a no kill shelter uh mama cat's already adopted they're just gonna wait until the um babies are able to get away from mama which they can't quite get away from mama just yet fuck me fuck i hope you two do something good with your lives that i gave you the two of you, both of you players. Um, but, uh, like I specifically wanted Paragon Path. Exactly. Yes. A hundred percent Paragon. Um, that was one of the specific requirements was it had to be a no kill shelter. And I wanted them all to be able to go together, like to the same shelter. I obviously understand that probably nobody's going to adopt a mama cat and five babies, like obviously. But I wanted them to be together until they started getting adopted out. Excuse me. So, um, and uh, I finally got word, I think it was on Friday, uh, that this specific shelter would take them. You don't know that. I do know that. I do know that. <laughs> They're not going to, they can't, they can't separate them just yet. They're too little. The babies will be fine in a few weeks. Yeah, yeah. They're still, they're still nursing from mom. So they can't be separated yet. Like they're 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 eating solid food too, but they're primarily nursing with mom yet. Um, and until they're they're done doing that, <laughs> they're they're not gonna separate them. Um, but anywho, let's do. We're gonna take this as a survivor. We're gonna do pallets. Drop pallets while being chased by a killer 18 times. Fuck, man. Imagine if human parenthood was done within a year of birth. That's crazy. I know. Like, I know. I feel like, I mean, I'm obviously I'm going to be a parent till the day I die. Right. But I feel like with humans, you're literally the parent until you die. You know what I mean? Like my dad is still parenting me. You know what I mean? And I'm a parent myself. Animals be crazy. Yeah, it's permanent. Yeah, it's permanent for us. It is permanent. Look at her with her cute bunny ears there. Fangment. Can confirm from both sides of that question. For sure. Me too. <laughs> me too. But yeah, and then once once the um, mama can be uh, weaned away from the babies, uh, the receptionist there had already said that she adopted her like she she's already chosen her like she she fell in love with her the second she met her um the one thing in particular though was they were outside for like at least two weeks like i can personally confirm at least two weeks and um they had no fleas none of them none of them had fleas which was to me that's interesting like that the babies because like obviously the mom could have been treated right like the owner could have treated her and then found out she was pregnant and you know dumped her um they didn't have collars of course obviously the babies didn't have fleas either which was interesting uh, uh to me at least yeah that's good luck that uh-huh yes yes they also um from what i could tell now again like i didn't really handle them too 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 much uh just enough to you know catch them 
and feed them and stuff like that. Because I was testing to see if they ate solid food, testing to see if they were friendly. Do I have? Oh, I didn't. I don't have a toolbox. Um, testing to see if I could pick them up. You know what I mean? Because those are requirements for like this type of shelter that I that I took them to. And uh, I couldn't tell really if they had like mites and stuff in their ears, but it didn't look like it. Could be one of them flea pills and the effect passed on from her last dose. I don't know if that's even a thing though. Well, it could be um, a thing like, uh, for example, like if she got that dose that's like a drop on the back of her neck, you know what I'm talking about? That liquid one that they put on the back of their necks. That's like a, a, a radial thing. You know what I mean? Like if the babies are within like, I don't know what it is. A couple of feet, they get the residual protection. Oh yeah, that one too. So yeah, they'd be close enough for that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But that kind of gives me like a lot of confidence in my yard then because I assume because you know yards you can you can have a backyard that's infested with fleas um but that gives me kind of confidence that that there's no fleas in my backyard you know what I mean because if I were to get a dog uh, the first thing I would do is treat my yard for fleas because I would be fucking furious if I brought a dog home he went outside she went outside and they got fleas immediately The concentrate droplet deal. Yeah, yeah. I had a dog that, um, this was years ago, but they couldn't do that concentrated droplet thing for him because it irritated his skin. So we could only do flea collars. And even that, we had to put something on the inside of the collar and, and like wrap it because it would irritate like if it was digging through his fur like to his skin eventually it would irritate his skin too son of a bitch this is fine i think i could still finish it before she gets over here a dust skull in the chat oh god if he was here he'd be going nuts I'm gonna try and catch it though. It's so cute. It's like a little ghosty face. I mean, it is a ghost type though, right? Ghost fly, maybe? It is! Yay! I am the worst when it comes to identifying Pokemon. We kind of made it like a game for a little while that every time the Pokemon would show up on the for the community game, I would guess what type it is. And I can tell you this, I'm awful. Awful. Oh god, I almost fucked that up. Oh, in the basement, man. I don't have any hooks. I feel like I should be the one to go. Shit. After this gen. After this gen. That way they only gotta get one more. Just, just one more gen. Just one more. Just one more. Oh, never mind. Somebody got them already. Excellent. Offspring is also home. I can hear you, but I'm busy. <laughs> all right, all right. That person is still hooked in the bait. Well, it's a different person now hooked in the basement. Hi, Offspring. Ew, why'd you fart? Oh, yep, that's what it was. I farted. Yep. I have no shame. I will fart on stream. I don't care. 
You're a goober. Offspring, everybody. That one's done. Come here. Come here, you. Come here, you. Let me get my hands on you and heal you. God, I haven't dropped one single pallet. Like, I haven't gotten chased, though, either, so... YouTube. What's the map do? It's not helping me at all. What the fuck's the map do? goodness well oh, psycho ghost you're a goner all right they're chasing the other person I can go back This one's done. Fuck, I really don't want that one in the middle, man. Okay, this is good. This is good. They're all the way over there. All the way over there. Doso was working on this one, but I started working on it and they left. Like, do I smell? Maybe they're going for the save. Too. I don't hear the killer. Are you camping people? I've only seen them like the one time. Oh, I can't make it. I'm sorry, boo. Maybe if I wouldn't have been greedy. But I most certainly was. Where the hell is the other person? Yes, we did it. Okay, excellent. Woo! Oh, God. You do. I didn't do one fucking pallet. Not one. Not one. I don't know what the hell the killer was doing. I almost want to... I almost feel like they were kind of camping. But I, I gained the map. What does that even mean? Level 72. Fuck. I hope they weren't camping. I hope I didn't just... Well, I mean, that doesn't mean anything when we when we do all that, so... It just grades the map, right? Oh, let me get my rewards. Do-do-do. All right, excellent. Let me see the time. You know what? I am going to do this. Um, Cause my headache's not getting any better at all. 
So we're going to raid out somewhere just because, like, my fucking brain. Also, I cannot stress to you how badly I have to pee right now. And I need to, like, do that badly. <laughs> I'm sorry that's too much information. Um, we're going to raid this person. Uh, we're gonna raid V. V is playing uh, Celeste, which looks really cute as fuck. See you, Fire. No, see you, see you. Thank you so much for being here. I've missed you. I hope all of you are doing well. I hope your night goes amazing. I hope those of you that need to go pee, go pee. And um, I hope you guys have a really amazing next couple of days. And I will hopefully see you guys on Wednesday or in your own streams if you are uh, also streamers. Otherwise, that's that. Thank you so much. Please say hi to V when we get there. All right. Thanks so much. Bye.